Are we live? Yes, we are. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I'm Simon Preston, and welcome to Reggae Boys Commentary. Yeah, don't be phased by my surroundings. It's just a different part of the house that I'm in, okay? That's Brazil. That's... So Brazil? Yeah, that's also Brazil. No. Yes, that's also Brazil. Yeah, a lot of different artifacts. Brazil, Chile, Mexico. You know, thanks to, to God, I, I was able to accomplish my dream this year of going to 30 countries before the age of 30. So I'm grateful and blessed in that respect. So it's all about hard work, guys, and you'll get exactly where you need to get to in life. So look, you all have been asking have been asking, have been asking, have been flooding my DMs on Instagram. Literally flooding it. I haven't seen so much DMs in my entire life in one day. I woke up this morning and I see six DMs. Guys, I am not going to put out false information. I'm not going to speculate. But when I do have information, like I do have some now, I will provide it. And you can trust that it is reliable, credible, and accurate. I will never, ever, ever try to make you guys feel like you're not in the loop you know that you can reach out to me and i have no problem with you dming me on on, on twitter or on instagram or in the comments i have no problem with that at all absolutely no problem but just know if you don't hear from me for a period of six to twelve hours that means that something is cooking that means that something is being worked on that means that something is happening and you need to trust the process that things will happen I know, next week, Sunday, the Reggae Boys face Panama in our first home game in the World Cup qualifiers, and just in a matter of pff, hours, really, we're going to face Mexico in our first World Cup qualifier at the Azteca. Yep. Yep, so the stance is set that we will only be able to have we won't be able to have the complement of our UK based players for the Mexico and the Costa Rica games, those that are attached to clubs. So Mariapa who is not at a club, he would be available for all three games. But Peter Lee Vassal has a recall. Romario Williams, Javan East, Norman Campbell. Ricardo Morris is supposed to be the only local base player, domestic base player in the squad. Liam Moore, Mikel Antonio are all are both supposed to Kemaruf are supposed to be here. So I have to find out now because even yeah, because there's no fans for that game. But even if you're going to work, like I have my intentions to do so, I have to do a COVID test. So the company has to I have to find out when that COVID test will be. I think it's 72 hours before. So I have to work on that, you know, I'm going to work on getting a COVID test. Yeah. So I can enter the stadium. I'm fully vaccinated, but protocols by CONCACAF say that whether you are working or, or you're a volunteer, that you need a COVID test. So if I'm going to be at the stadium in a working sense, then I'm going to have to, I'm just going to have to make sure that I go and get that, the, the prerequisite test that is needed, test negative, and yeah. So hopefully all will go well, you know? So I'm hoping.
yeah that's the reality of the situation so yeah what else can be said i know i gave you essentially seven or eight names the reality is that the players at the, as it stands haven't had their tickets purchased as yet but the plan is to have a charter flight from to mexico on tuesday arrive tuesday evening train wednesday play thursday that is the intention so i know the game is nine o'clock jamaica time so might do like a, a preview in a sense for the game on the wednesday so i'm thinking if i should go live yeah i might as well i think that would be imperative on my part but we'll work that out when, when the, t the time progresses but you should all know that this is the place where you come for the latest and, re and reliable information so when you need the information when you need the content this is exactly where you need to come this is exactly where you need to be peter lee vassal romaria williams Japan east norman campbell carter morris will be available for the panama and costa rica games as it relates to the other games the one that is at the national stadium we've pinned down antonio we've pinned down kemaru we've pinned down liam moore and we're still trying to get other pieces together. So the reason why those are the only names so far is because we can safely tick. Still, there are other names to the list that will be revealed at some point that those names have to be confirmed that they can travel based on the itinerary they've been given because you know how it is sometimes a JFF might have a play on two or three flights just to get to a location. So. It really, really depends, plus COVID tests. So as it stands, as we speak right, right now, those are the names confirmed. Once I get the rest, you all will know. I promise you, you all will know. Once those other names are confirmed, are sealed, are settled, are done and dusted, I can tell you as a fact, as a fact, that you all will know. 150 percent absolutely so that's something for you to look out for so reggae boys fans how do you feel based on the names that i've provided how do you feel about the recall of peter lee vassal after essentially two years well a year and change because he played against bermuda in a friendly match in march 2020 when jamaica recorded its first person first two covid cases so he's back after a year and change how do you feel let me know your thoughts in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe to reggae boys commentary for more content take care